Hilliard City School students are getting ready to go back into the classroom for the first time in months. Thanks for joining us for NBC4 at 11. I'm Jennifer Bullock. For some, their first day of in-person learning is just hours away. NBC4's Eric Kalperin is live in Hilliard tonight. And Eric, how are families feeling about this first day back? Jennifer, some are excited, some are nervous, some are both. They've already had a week of remote learning, and as they say here in Hilliard, the families we talked with today say they are ready for tomorrow. Come Monday morning, the doors at Station 6th grade school will once again be open to students. One of the students who will be walking in is Maddie Brogan. I think I'm more excited than scared just because it's been like eight months feels like it. Her mom Jenny says last week of remote learning was a big improvement from the spring. And last week, Maddie got a sneak peek of one of her classrooms. In the Zoom meeting, our teacher showed us like our tables and there's like plastic stuff where our seats are. And that's pretty nerve wracking. Many precautions are being taken from increased cleaning to changes to bus procedures, meals and more. The state's eighth largest school district announced the switch to hybrid learning after Franklin County went from red to orange on the state's coronavirus alert system last week. I'm ready to get back. Or I'm ready for her to get back. It'll be good for them to be with friends and be with teachers and get real hands on learning. Maddie goes back on Monday. Fifth grader Navin Oster goes back Tuesday. The district's been split up by last name. He's in group B. The groups alternate weekly between who goes two or three days. Oster says it might be confusing at times, but he's ready. I'm excited because I haven't like been in a classroom for a long time. Fourth grader Eliana Gabriel Hannes is ready too. I'm excited to see friends and teachers. As a school year like no other continues. We're ready to go back. We're excited for this year. And Hilliard has an all online academy available too. those who are sending their kids to school are reminded to take their kids temperatures and the superintendent here in Hilliard is reminding drivers to take it slower tomorrow morning because school buses are going to be back out on the roads and kids are going to be back at bus stops live and local for you in Hilliard. I'm Eric Halpern, NBC4.